Hey guys, it's Fajin from Fajin TV, here for your entertainment. And today, I'm going to be doing a story time. My head's kind of cut off. Does that irk you guys? Let me see if I can fix this. Okay. Alright, I look better. So I'm going to do a funny New Year's story time. Girl, I almost didn't see 2018. Like, my dad almost killed me. Like, almost killed the whole family. <laughs> And I'm like so dead ass. <laughs> like, we're gonna get into the story. So, it was a Friday. It was definitely a Friday. And I think this was a Friday before New Year's. So, I had a hair appointment in the morning. And mind you, it was super cold. You know, it's snowing. I live in New York, if any of you didn't know. I live in New York. It's super cold, like 19 degrees. Like, that's cold to me, okay? But, like, I'm, I was freezing. I had, like, five jackets on. <laughs> and so funny. So I was supposed to get my hair done. I did, actually, guys. You realize I cut my hair? I'm, I'm, <laughs> okay. I got my hair done. I was supposed to get my hair done with my mom. My mom wanted to get her hair done, too. So we were supposed to carpool together. But she was taking so long. And my mom, like, she's not, she on that Caribbean people time. Like, she really be on something else. Like, you say 5 o'clock, she'll be there at 6 o'clock. That's 5 o'clock. Like, <laughs> you're 7 or 8. Like, she does not care. Like, you sp you if you make a point with her, lie to her. She'd be on some real Caribbean people time. I like being prompt. I could be late, but, like, I like being prompt. And I wanted to get my hair done get it over with just because my work schedule is kind of unreliable. Like... I never know what I'm going in. They just always call me to come in. So it's like, I need to get this done. So just in case if they call me. So um, I want to go get my hair done. So yeah. Ugh, duh. Okay, so she was taking so long. So I told her, okay, forget it. Like, I'm going to go with my own car. And she could just meet me there with her own car. I was not carpooling that day. Before I left, my dad, he's like, can I, Feijin, can I use your space heater? I have a space heater in my room because I'm like, I swear I'm anemic. I'm always cold. And like, even though we have heat, it's like, I need to be warmer. Who's calling me? My mom. Hello? Okay, okay. I come. She's calling me for some food. All right, guys. So, yeah, so my dad asked me for the space heater, and I said, I get, I feel like I'm always cold. I always like to, like, make my room extra warm, but, like, before I go to bed. So, he asked me if he could use it, and I said, yes. I didn't know what he was using it for. I go start my car, I'm ready to leave, like, but before I leave, I see my dad with the space heater in the garage. On! But the garage door is open. I'm looking at this man, like... Why did you go take my space heater to have it with the garage door open? He's like, oh no, I'm going to close the garage. But he's working on his car. And if anybody doesn't know, when you're working on your car and you have, um, you're working on your car, your car built and your car's on, it builds up carbon monoxide. That's why you got to let your garage door, leave your garage door open. But I had to, I, I like mentioned, I was like, what are you talking about? But he said that his car was off, like he, he was just fixing a tire. So I didn't think twice of it. I leave, I go get my hair done. As you can see, got my hair done. <laughs> so I went to go get my hair done, I left. Um, I come back home, you know, I had some food, I came back home, I was excited to eat. Season 4, Black Mirror just came. If you guys watch Black Mirror, please let me like comment down below let me know okay because i fucking love that series like they're so it's so good like oh my god so season four black mirror i come home you know i'm ready to go watch that my food and it's my like the only people that are home is my brother and my dog okay so but when i come home the smell that attacked me i was like what's that smell Jeff, what's that smell? My brother's name is Jeff. <laughs> so, like, he's like, yo, I don't even know. But, like, but like he said, I smell something earlier, but I don't smell anything anymore. And I'm like, I smell something like paint thinner, something sickly sweet. But I was like, maybe my dad was painted. He swear he's a handyman, a handyman. So, I didn't think anything twice of it. My dad wasn't home. So, I, and the crazy thing is I was re ready to take a nap because I was so tired. My work schedule is crazy. Holiday season just ended. So, it's like, I used to be working nine, ten hour shifts. But, like, now it's, like, six hours. So, yeah. So, I was just really tired. Um, 
So I get, um, so I was just like, you know what, let me just watch Black Mirror. Let me just go. I was going to watch it in my room, lay down, but I was just like, something told me not to. I go into my, um, my living room and I start watching it on the Roku, Roku, whatever you, way you pronounce it. And I'm watching it. And we have a carbon monoxide alarm. Two seconds later, I hear a beep, beep. <laughs> yo i was not playing that yo once i heard that i knew it was a carbon monoxide alarm because guys we have a fire alarm but we turned it off like and it's after this shit happened we turned that shit back on i knew it was a carbon monoxide alarm i go to see what it says, it says if you see this alarm ringing go to get, cl get clear air 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 <laughs> what do i say i can't even speak bro i take i had a blanket when i was in the living room i took my blanket i took my dog i went to my brother's room like yo the carbon monoxide alarm is on i took i took my dog my blanket my car keys i'm out literally it's 19 degrees outside i have puma fenty slippers on not even shoes and it's and there's like snow outside Oh my god. And I, I'm in my car and I'm calling my dad, I'm calling my mom, I'm calling my I'm calling and my mom was in the hair salon, so she's like under the heater, so I, the dryer, whatever. So she she probably was not gonna see her phone. Me and my brother are panicking, like what the fuck is going on? Of course my dad would do some dumb shit like this. <laughs> Yo, we're like we're like spazzing and I'm just like this is crazy, like what's going on? Carbon monoxide leaking through the house, like so we end up calling the police my dad's still not answering his phone turns out he left his phone home so that's why he wasn't answering um i like we called the police the police uh, we had like two police officers two three fire trucks like one two paramedics just everybody uh, and mind you guys i live on a dead end so you you just know like they just all came and like they were um so they were like investigating they were asking us questions mind you it was freezing i put my dog in my car i just didn't want to say my car i wanted to know what's going on i was so cold my my dad finally came mind i guess he did end up turning his car on he turned up he turned on his car and his justification is that he had opened the garage door to let carbon monoxide out and closed it back because it was too cold so this man left his car running, went to Home Depot, and that's what made the carbon monoxide seep into the house and that's what made the alarm turn on. And it's crazy because we, I was ready to fall asleep. Mind you, if we didn't have a carbon monoxide alarm, yo, we would have been out. Like that's crazy. Like what is with my that? <laughs> like the carbon monoxide level was at 60%. Good thing the alarm you know uh, alerted us and then we called the, pol the, the police and the fire department we ended up they ended up having to turn off our gas um to like find the source i don't know how they ended up like turn like getting the levels down but because i ended up going to my neighbor's house it was too fucking cold she made us hot cocoa she gave us cornbread i was happy <laughs> what neighbors i have right so um that was crazy we ended up going back home um so they had to turn off the gas for a couple days because what had happened oh there was a leak also in like the boiler room so that's a good thing that we ended up um having the carbon monoxide leak because then we found another leak in the boiler room and if we didn't find that leak in the boiler room it, we could have had a fire we got that fixed and now it's a funny joke because i'm always like dad you could have almost killed me dad dad like my dad's always getting mad he's just like no <laughs> it's so bad like damn i could have lost my dad i could have lost my dog myself my brother my mom we would have all been dead like that's crazy my dad learned a fucking lesson like if it's cold, then don't work on your car, because you shouldn't be working on your car with the garage door closed, no matter how. It, it be New York, like, it's really cold, so, yeah, so that was the craziest experience of the end of the year, like, basically, I almost didn't see 2018, like, I told my dad, like, damn, you was really trying to kill me, like, I just wanted to see 2018, let me prosper, this is my year. <coughs> Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that little story. I have so many funny stories to tell you guys. Like, oh my god, my life is kind of like a fucking joke. So, if you guys enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up. Um, give this video, yeah, a like. Come on. <laughs> um, comment down below if you want other story times. Comment to comment. Happy New Year. <laughs> um, and subscribe. Join my family. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.